Apple product placement. And know that in time you will find your salvation. Snappy. So what you Yagami, say? are you still with us? Can you please translate the following sentence into English? This teacher notices and picks on the one student in the entire classroom not chit-chatting, reading a magazine, or clearly playing on a handheld console. What a douche. Wait, on the off chance someone really dies, would that make me a murderer? Yes, just like pulling a trigger on a gun, it still makes the user a killer. The same assailant who attacked six people at a busy shopping district in Shinjuku yesterday has struck again, taking eight people hostage at this daycare center. Random bad guy who deserves to die, ex machina. The suspect has been found dead inside! <laughs> I repeat, the suspect is now dead! Dead? The special forces are denying allegations that they shot the suspect. Do the police really have to strongly deny this? I mean, you'd have heard gunshots and there were none. Wanna come? Yeah, of course! Oh, there's no way I'm missing that. Damn it! Why is my mom so useless? She's never here to pick me up on time! I have a sneaky suspicion as to why this kid's getting bullied. Uh, 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 Let's go, boys! Uh, Strip her down uh, right here! Uh, Are you sure? No! Stop! <laughs> Please! Help me! These cunts are literally physically attacking and talking about sexually assaulting a girl right in the middle of the street in front of a convenience store. You've taken quite a liking to it. <laughs> no reason to act surprised. Well there is because you're a giant monster looking thing in a human world where things that look like you only exist in fairy tale books and... Hollywood. Well, I'm not surprised. In fact, Ryuk, I've been waiting for you. Oh? It's a bit late to be pulling that one, dude, especially after having fallen off of your desk chair and screamed. In other words, the notebook is now yours. This is mine? If you don't want it, just give it to someone else. It's like I'm watching a creepy anime version of 24. What is it? I thought you'd like some apples. The neighbors brought them over for us. Why on earth is it so dark in your room? You ruined your eyesight. What's going on? Well, that's a weird myth. Plus, he's saving on your electric bill. That's why I wrote the instructions in English, the most popular language in the human world. Sorry, dude, but Chinese would have come first, followed by Spanish. But if he's talking purely about a random drop to earth and the likelihood of it dropping in an English-speaking country, he's probably about right. But then 71% of the world's surface is water, so who the f knows? At long last, his dream had finally come true. So what happened with your dad after that? Alright then, Yagami? Mm -hmm. Please recite this line for us. This teacher once again is a knobhead and asks the one guy with his head down to stand up and do some work. Hey, what's up, Light? We were just gonna head down Sorry, to I'm a little busy today. You don't have anything to do. Aren't you just gonna go home and hang out in your room as usual? If you have to ask this, then you can't say you don't have anything to do, can you? Huh? Weird. Hey, Light, what's going on? Why is your door locked? Masturbation. Oh. <laughs> We're treating this as an elaborate murder plot that's been carried out by a large organization. If it is a large organization, I'm sure I'm not alone in suspecting the FBI or CIA. I dare you to say that again! That's Americanist. If that's the case, it looks as if we'll have no choice but to bring in L. <laughs> Every single person in the room knows who L is to the point that they all stop talking. Uh, Chief, what's this L they're talking about? Alright, fair play. Gentlemen. L has already begun his investigation into these incidents. What are you? In this well-lit room, this man appears as though he stood in the dark alleyway at night. L would now like to address the delegates. Opening up this laptop lid automatically links it to any large screen nearby. Handy for when you want to look professional. This case cannot be solved without the full cooperation of the ICPO. This guy just had to be fancy and have his water in a wine glass. I require additional cooperation from Japan's National Police Agency. <gasps> what? Why Japan in particular? Um, because it's happening in your country, dude. 
You know I'm not going to be demanding to work with the El Salvadorian police to solve this, am I? I'm removing a sin here for this awesome scene that really shows off how clever not only Light is, but the anime itself in general. It all comes down to a choice. Would I prefer to be executed or deal with a little house fire? Well, that little fire would quickly turn into a big fire since it's inside a desk. Criminals around the world are being murdered by a serial killer. I consider this crime to be the most atrocious act of murder in history. Yeah, the Holocaust pales in comparison. Removing a sin for this tremendous end to the second episode. It once again proves just how clever this anime is and is just genuinely exciting to watch. However, nobody could provide any information that wasn't already publicly available. And lastly, this week there were an additional 21 people who called in claiming to be Kira. Hmm. <coughs> Did he... touch his leg under the table or something? Uh, yes sir. What is it, Matsuda? Um, well I'm not saying this to support Kira or to condone the murders, but... In the last few days throughout the world, but especially here in Japan, we've observed a dramatic decrease in the number of violent crimes committed. Uh, Everyone seems disappointed that serious crime has dropped. Files popping up sound effect helps us to know that files are popping up. Saying snap out of it to a clearly still and dead prisoner. No other prisoners were concerned when he was showing off his orgasm face and ripping his shirt open, but as soon as his head drops down, they look. He can grant that human the eyes of a Shinigami. Slight exhale and inhale cliche. By some human before he could get to it. No way! Then he'd be stuck there till the end of that human's life or until the Death Note was destroyed. Now we know who stole Mr. T's jewelry! Cop assumes that just because the light in the room has been turned off that he has ceased all activity for the night, but more so that he's even still in there. What is it, Watari? Picture appearing sound effects helps us, the viewer, to know that pictures are appearing. Walking downstairs with your eyes closed. A date? Yeah. It's a date no matter how you look at it. And I'm sure even my stalker will see it that way. But this isn't just a date, is it? Okay, this is just getting weird now. Open your fucking eyes, dude! Sorry, did I keep you waiting? No, not at all. Anyway, I haven't been to Spaceland since junior high. I'm so excited. Considering how close those stairs are, I'm amazed that A, it took him so long to reach her, and B, that she never heard Light talking to himself. And don't make me wait! If you mess with me at all, or try to get the police involved, I swear I'll kill every one of these passengers! <laughs> Must be one of those new bus phones made of Oreos. <laughs> Plans for a date, huh? Stupid kid! Yeah, Light, you fucking moron. No one goes on dates anymore. It's all about the hell we're in now. It's not the bus! Let me off! During this time of the cop running forward and the man begging for the bus to stop and then jumping off and getting hit by the car, the cop somehow never catches up to him. Perhaps Japanese buses are a lot longer than we think. That's enough. <laughs> Look darling, you and I know you used to be one of the best agents in the FBI, but now you're my fiancé Naomi, we talked about this. You're not an agent anymore, so just leave it alone. That's fiancé -ist. Do you see the man working over there at the coffee shop? That's right, the one sweeping the floor. I'm gonna kill him just for you. But... but how? Don't do it. Ah, he was doing a shit job anyway. Removing a sin here for how excellently clever this scene was, and when I saw this for the first time I was so impressed by the attention to detail and just how expertly it was played out. Dead. No, he was... he was murdered by Kira. One-sided emotional eye-leaking. 
I think it's honorable of you, Dad. I'm proud to be able to call you my father. Best save that praise until he's actually done something praiseworthy. <sighs> this dude looks like an undercover criminal due to the fact that he has no eyebrows. Nations agree to send 1,500 investigators to Japan. For Kira, this will be way beyond what he faced with the FBI. He'll see everyone as a potential threat. Psychologically, he'll start to feel cornered, and that will cause him to take some kind of drastic action. <sighs> Th that's interesting. So he'll think there are 1,500 when there are really only seven of us. Wow, you're quick to catch on, aren't you? Hey, yeah, that's right. I like the sound of that. We can do this! Alright then, let's do this, Ryazaki. One person talks exactly after the next cliché. Ah yes, the MPAMPSC. And I believe they enable him to somehow control his victims before they die. So do I. It's odd that you say that, because that's exactly what I've been thinking. Are they... stood in the middle of the road right now? Oh, it's nothing. But the more I think about it, the more your theory makes sense to me. It's just occurred to me that I've never seen the car actually driving in this or the last episode and they've been walking along a road for like 15 minutes. But after speaking with you one on one, I don't feel the need. Oh. Excuse me? Hypocrite! My experiments indicate that in a situation like this, I should be able to control a person's actions. So what's wrong? <laughs> <laughs> it's not funny. Oh no, what if my father calls back now? I already promised her that I'd let her talk to him if he did. If this phone rings, it's all over for me. What am I gonna do? Stop walking, take your phone out, look like you're texting, but turn it off, nod in an interesting and fake manner, and then put it back in your pocket. You're welcome. Thanks for explaining, but just to be safe, I'd like to try and visit the task force headquarters again. Uh huh. Goodbye. Please, wait a second. It's like I just told you, they won't let you talk to anyone. Yeah, this doesn't look suspicious at all. Chasing her down the street. You can't speak to headquarters. Trust me, I'll help you. Give me your f***ing name! Removing a sin here for this great scene. After we spent the whole episode on Edge as to how he would possibly be able to turn this around to work in his favour, and then that final moment where the doom sets into her eyes is brilliantly done. Well, apparently she's been missing since the day after her fiancé died. I'm sure that anyone in her situation would be pretty depressed. Was it? Suicide. No, the Naomi Misura I knew was strong. Not to mention she was also an excellent FBI agent. If anything, it's more likely she'd be trying to catch Kira. Assumes that because she was strong in her line of work as a person, that mentally she was strong outside of work in her relationship and home life. Sometimes most people put up some kind of front in their work life, and this front only gets worse the more stressful a line of work it is. In reality, for all they know, she could have been crumbling to pieces as a result of what happened. It seems like you're pretty skilled with your hands. I bet you're pretty popular with the girls, aren't you? Sexual innuendo. Chief? I don't have to tell you how offended I am to learn my family is under suspicion. Having said that, just go ahead with it. Oh. And make sure you install them everywhere. I don't want any blind spots in the house, and that includes the bathroom. Well, this is getting weird. Would be very funny if Elle was saying, No, I don't think the bathroom would be necessary. No, they need to be everywhere. In the toilet bowl, shower head and plug hole, everywhere. And I want my own set of tapes too, for research purposes. I don't believe it. I never knew he went to such great lengths. Putting a piece of paper in the door is considered going to great lengths. Oh, ah, I have to find the cameras. <laughs> I can't believe my son is looking at those magazines. Well, they might not be the kind of magazines you'd look at, weirdo, but that's normal. But didn't that mini LCD TV cost you 400 bucks? Good morning. Garbage man is a dick and doesn't say good morning back. So what should I do? Ideally, I would get to know him well enough that he'd admit to me that he was Kira. Perfect reflection in a cup of coffee. Student number 162, sit properly in your chair. Hmm? Teacher snubbing. 
Either he's crazy or he's just toying with us. If the paperwork was blank, then he may as well have simply read it out aloud without awkwardly having to hold it like this. I want to tell you I'm out. What? There's no way. What's he talking about? If he really was L, he'd never admit to it. Dude, f blink. You're creeping me out. The reason I chose to reveal my identity to you is because I think you could be of some help to us on the Kira investigation. Throughout this whole conversation, not one person has told them to shut the f up and listen to the speech. What an amazing car! A limousine? Well, I'm sure I'll see you on campus. No, that is far from a limo. I'm very sorry, sir. We're under orders from L not to discuss the case with anyone, including you. I'm not asking for details here, just what you're doing and where. Well, that is basically the whole thing, isn't it, Einstein? You know, Yagami, it's been four months since this case came to the public's attention and they want results. People are saying that the NPA is incompetent, that L is incompetent. With all due respect, sir, the rest of the department runs away with their tails between their legs and we're incompetent. He never said he shared that opinion. This could have been the start of an entirely different sentence like, people are saying that the NPA and L are incompetent. So go show him different, Tiger. In my opinion, he's a lot more capable than we are right now. Even as we speak, he's risking his life. Jesus, he really has f cool confidence in his son, doesn't he? Not to mention we're so out of the way here, no one's gonna give you a hard time about the way you sit. I don't sit like this because I want to, I have to sit like this. You see, if I were to sit normally, my deductive skills would immediately be reduced by roughly 40%. This is a really odd and probably incorrect fact. If it bleeds, it leads. What I need is a good freaking story, not this crap. Fantu. Darling. This can't be good for your health. Please, you have to rest. Hospital bread bin. Sachko, like it or not, I am still in charge of the Kira task force. <sighs> Holding a small TV remote with two hands. Whatever camera is being used at this distance definitely wouldn't then go on to give this quality when zoomed in. If we rush down there unprepared, all of us will be killed. Wasn't it you who said we'd have to risk our lives to catch Kira? Aggressive one-shouldered massage. Off-duty police officer steals a police vehicle and causes massive amounts of damage to a private building. Better lose his job though and be taken to court for damages, I hear you say. Well, you'd be wrong. You're gonna be killed right here and now if you don't give those tapes to me! What? Come on, what the hell do you think you're doing? Right, surely he'll be having criminal charges against him now though, right? <laughs> Guess again. If you don't take control of this situation quickly, there will be a disaster. But... Technically, we're not supposed to be involved in this case. Huh. I understand, L. I see your point now. Tell me what I should do. Jesus, how long have you been doing this job? Fucking six months? You should know what you're doing, you numpty. Make sure there are no gaps! Do not reveal your faces! We know that Kira is not in the building! He is outside! It takes the Tokyo police five minutes to set this up. There is a very good chance that Kira is still in the vicinity of the station. As you move out, proceed with caution. You are not to remove your helmet. The man who says this is the only one not covering his face. Slurping. Blight, Ryuzaki has decided that he'd like you to help with the investigation. If you're still interested, then you need to come here right away. Okay, Dad. <laughs> All along I've been trying to find a way to get involved in the investigation, but I never thought they would actually approach me. Well, he did already ask you back in episode 10. However, it's made me that much more determined to work with you on this investigation. I think I managed to make it believable. The Past, brought to you by people writing on large pieces of parchment. 
If this person claiming to be me is truly sympathetic to my cause and wishes to be of some help, I ask two things of him. That he refrain from killing aimlessly and that he agree to abide by my basic principles. Could be and is actually a she. Please do not worry. I will follow orders and do as you say. Wow, it worked. I will do as you say, huh? This guy's gonna be no help at all. If this fake had any idea what my wishes were, he'd insist that Elle appear on TV and then kill him anyway. How could you fall for something like this? Damn it. I really want to meet you. The message is quiet for some time to allow for Light to have some internal monologue. Ah, oh, I'm so tired. That's what she said. Hey, Rem. Huh? Hold up. Wait a second, could it... could it be? It's not like that. I wasn't the one who killed him. I just happened to be around when he died. Oh, not that old chestnut. I just happened to be walking by with a bloodied knife when the guy died. <coughs> Worst strikes with a blade in the history of people striking with blades. <laughs> Shinigami orgasm. Hello, dear. You're back quite late today. Little obvious comments like that will get your ass on the note. With all of us walking together like this, even if Ryuk is seen, no one would be able to tell which one of us he's following. Removing another sin here for the anime being incredibly clever. All right, Rem. Time to go. Huh. You finally found him and now you just want to leave? Well, I can't go up to him and say, Hi Kira, nice to meet you. I'm the one who sent you the messages with all these people around. Yeah, because seemingly having a detailed conversation with yourself in a public place never draws any attention. Despite this little clause, the death note can still be used to kill fucking toddlers. That is messed up. I already told you, I don't care even if all you do is use me. Believe me. Dude, take the f***ing deal! <gasps> Sexual hug. Sexually hugging a sex doll. Also, Mr. Yagami. Oh, yes? Please ask Mr. Mogi to start following Light so we can keep tabs on what he's doing. You want him followed? No, he just likes to say to have him followed when he really means to make me a cup of tea. Can you do this? No need to ask. Just tell me what to do and I'll do it. I don't care what it is, because I do anything for you. Anal. Is that me from Bradbury? I do anything for you. <laughs> You're seriously going to date other girls? Yeah, more or less. I don't want you to! <laughs> if I see you with another girl, I'll kill her. Well, that sure went you know gas I fast, didn't it? But if you were to use your death note to save her, wouldn't that mean you'd die too? That's right! If you tried to save me, you would die too! Jesus, girl, we don't need you confirming every piece of information. Damn it. She's nothing but trouble. Another arch nemesis of Leafy. <clears throat> fake eating sounds fake. Look, light. You've got to stop that. I don't like hearing you say, if I were Kira, even hypothetically. Says the guy who told his boss, El is risking his life right now, when he was first making contact with Light. Bitch. Oh! Oh, great to see you, Misa. I saw you in a whole bunch of magazines. Please, come on in. Were they just assuming she was coming over? We could be happy together. It's all I ever wanted. It's all I've ever wanted for the last 24 hours. Really? That's so sweet of you. Hey, oh my god, isn't that girl Misa Misa? You're right, it's her. Oh, she's so cute. Oh wow, I should have guessed I'd be spotted with all these kids around. All of these people know a high school model. I'm like your biggest fan. Keep up the good work. Oh, thank you. Couldn't do it without you. Yes, you could. Uh, uh, this is an outrage. Uh, taking advantage of this situation is unforgivable. I will find whoever is responsible for this. 
<laughs> oh, Ryuga, you're so funny. Sexual assault included for comedic purposes. <laughs> I wanna touch her too. <laughs> Sexual assault. <laughs> it's been fun. I'm grateful that I was the one to discover your name so I could kill you myself. Kind regards, Light Yagami. We gathered physical evidence from the envelopes that were sent by the second Kira. In particular, we recovered hairs and fibers from the masking tape used to seal them. They matched what we found in Misa's room. Okay, but how did they get a warrant to search a random girl's bedroom based upon... nothing? <sighs> yep, looks like a voluntary witness to me. Impossible! What makes you think I care where I am? It won't change anything! With the state I'm in now, this is the best place for me. And no matter what the result, when I leave here, it's going to be with my son! Removing a sin for him actually being a decent father for a change. If I have no memory of his crimes, I'm not him! I've never been able to accept this idea that Kira has been acting without self-awareness all this time. Yes, it's much easier to believe that Kira can kill people just by knowing their name and face because that's reality. Let's tell Light! Matsuda! I mean, please don't, Mr. Matsuda. Matsuda? That moment when you're so taken by surprise you say your own name instead of sorry. Poor guy must have been in that cell so long he couldn't control himself any longer. Honestly, all this time I never pictured you as an old man- That's old manist! That's so gross! You really are a pervert, aren't you? Light, please make Misa stop talking now. That's sexist! But yeah, shut the f*** up. You're taking advantage of me?! Ah! Stupid, 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 stupid! This happens! For the most part, your life will return to normal, but from now on, for all private and work-related affairs, Mr. Matsuda will be accompanying you as your new manager, Matsui. Your agency's been paid to keep quiet, and the police don't know, don't- And his voice is as though he's talking from 400 yards away. 23 floors above ground, and two below. Although it's impossible to see it from the outside, there are two helicopters hidden on the roof. The government builds all of this for a murder investigation in the middle of the city. Not to mention, our salaries have virtually eclipsed those of the other employees in the company. It's unlikely he would choose to back a particular company. They seriously need to call an electrician and get those lights sorted out. Human beings are truly disgusting creatures. That is absolutely humanist. just in case someone who doesn't give a shit tries to break in and do nothing. What's wrong? Did you get hurt? Yeah, oh, this? Kind of. <sighs> I had a little fight with my wife, and it's just that my daughter's still young, and I'm hardly ever at home as it is, so... Oh yeah, we've all been there. You're busy at work, not home much, so you get stabbed in the head with a fork by your wife. In just over a month, they all died of heart attacks. As expected, there's been a general downturn in the market, with the exception of Yotsuba. Graph appearing sound effects stop halfway through appearing Graph. I hear he and his mistress were in Italy at the time. Makes sense. If our request is physically impossible, then... Talking about what's physically impossible, those glasses staying on your face. Go with you to the park. Maybe we can go to the zoo together. Or the amusement park. <laughs> ah, family life. Mommy, why is Daddy crying? Because he's a pussy. <laughs> Littering. I punish evildoers and criminals if I could kill by just seeing a name and face? Is that what I'd do if I had that sort of power? Yes. I'll give you this strawberry if you mm -hmm. keep it a secret, okay? Mm. Strawberry bribery. And override the surveillance cameras in the Yotsuba Group's head office. Is that all? Yes. 
At this point, it's safe to assume that Kira and the Yotsuba group are connected in some way. Instant hairstyle change! This definitely wouldn't have worked. I mean, the mattress is about two feet over the ledge. What are you talking about? As long as we're joined by these, we would die together anyway. Well, yes, if like a car rammed into you, then it's likely, but other than that, no, that wouldn't happen. Hold on. At the same time, we can't say that he's definitely not among the seven. That means there's a chance the killings will stop if we take this opportunity to arrest them. If you are planning on arresting them, then I would suggest getting a police officer since none of you are officers anymore. Remember? You forget that if we win against Kira, Misa won't die. Besides, as long as we're handcuffed together, you and I share the same fate. Where the hell is this coming from? Why is there an assumption that because they're handcuffed together, if one of them is killed, the other will die? Because that would only happen if there was a very specific cause of death to one of them. For example, jumping off of a building or walking into traffic. Oh no, I think I've totally misunderstood you all this time. Her hands keep switching between having nail varnish on and not having it on. Figuring out the logistics of arresting seven people is going to be challenging. I don't suppose you two have any ideas. I have an idea. Go and get a fucking police officer. Misa Misa! Uh, what is it, Mochi? Today you have an interview with the Yotsuba group to see if they'll use you in their new ad campaign. But remember, this is also an infiltration mission, so stay sharp! CGI. Calm down and listen to me. Calm down? How can I? This thing looks like it's gonna kill me. Most restrained reaction to a giant monster grabbing a hold of you in a bathroom in the history of ever. It's disturbingly close to my ideals. <sighs> what the hell am I thinking? I'm not Kira. Something's gotta be wrong with me if I'm seriously comparing myself to that murderer. A murderer whose ideals you just said you shared. Oh my gosh, I'm so sorry it took so long. I was just fixing up my makeup a little. And having a big poo. <gasps> Attempting to look young again and just looking like a douchebag. What? After getting this far? Mm. Uh, do you know how difficult it is to break into someone's house? Besides, do you have any idea of how many cars this guy mm. has? No, he has six. Cheese Leia declares. Do you remember? Killing anyone, I mean. Huh? Are you still going on about that? Look, I'm not Kira. How many times do I- I just want you to answer the question. Well, do you remember? He did answer the question by saying he's not Kira, because if he's not him, then he can't have any memory of killing anyone. Or was there someone else in control of Light, lurking in the background, who gave him the power? Was it that person who passed Light's powers to someone else? Exploding apple caused by intense questioning. If we believe that this was the work of some being watching us from above, where are the hidden helicopters? He said you can hold your stupid private meetings by yourself. Go figure. <laughs> Good old Owie, always the blunt one. We can also rule out Kida as a possible suspect, as he was the one who provided the account for funds in order to commission Coil. Unless this glass has a hole in the bottom, it should definitely be filling up with liquid. To be honest, I've been debating for a long time whether or not I should make this announcement, but now that I'm here, I know I've done the right thing. The previously awesome looking and modern lamp on this table has now changed shape into a much less awesome looking lamp. Then what was his real name? I think it was Yamada. No, wait. Yamashita. Yeah, and his first name was... I'm sorry, I can't remember. Don't screw with me! Why the hell can't you remember the names of the people you hire? Alright, no need for that kind of language. What language? Screw and hell? Obviously this guy lives in Happy Cuddles and Puppy Land. <laughs> It's not funny. What do you think? Huh? What do I think? About what, may I ask? Rem, who's that? 21 seconds of silence allows for a discussion to take place at HQ. What a bastard! This is Traffic Control Squad! <laughs> <laughs> that motorcycle 
Babcock just rear-ended that truck. He's dead. He's dead. Although you wouldn't actually know if he was dead or not, to be fair. You'd have a good idea, judging by the speed he hit the truck. But it didn't look fatal. I'm sorry to do this, Misa. But I'm going to have to make sure you're restrained for a while. What? But that's... Could she not already guess what was happening by all the chains already on her? Dad, Higuchi's left Yotsuba. He's on his way to Sakura TV. He'll be there in less than 15 minutes. Are you ready? I don't need my son asking if I'm ready. Of course I am. That's Sunnist. To realize Akira is you ready, Mr. Yagami? Evil. It's almost time. I don't need some fit blonde woman asking if I'm ready. Of course I am. They must be taking precautions against Kira. In that case... I'm with the Yotsuba group from the development department. Let me show you my business card. They allow him to rifle through a bag before arresting him. <laughs> if the chief was able to react this quickly, then he could have stopped him from pulling out the gun in the first place. He'd just have to dive forwards instead of sideways. Damn it! I didn't want to have to use one of these, but... <laughs> After missing with the initial shot, of course the best thing to do is to stand still and scowl. Higuchi has a gun on him! The chief's been shot! Higuchi's escaping! I'm alright. Sorry, Ryuzaki. It requires two people to tend to a man with an arm grazed by a bullet. Despite there being quite some time difference between him escaping and the chief being helped up to leave, the cars are literally two and three seconds behind. A non-moving floodlight appears over the car, which can't be from the helicopter since there's no shadow behind the car and there aren't any other helicopters. Ryuzaki, please let me go and make the arrest. I'd like to come with you, Chief, if that's alright. All these guys still don't realise that they are not police officers anymore. Removing a sin for this whole awesome scene. Hmm. I like this dude, but L did say that if he chose to remain a police officer, he would never be allowed back into that building. Rem, was it? That's your name, isn't it? The white thing over there? Ryozaki, isn't it a bit rude to go around calling someone a white thing? Yeah, it's actually racist. For once, it is in fact racist. But what happens when I know it all, then what should I do after that? 90 seconds of walking around the city, occasionally killing people and not singing very well montage. Of course we can convict them! This guy's intentionally writing names in the notebook, knowing that these people are going to die! Assumptions, which do not work well in court. Even if we don't plan on publicly acknowledging the notebook, the least we can do is execute the killer! Rare moment catches Mogi having stuck a breadstick sideways into his mouth to see if anyone could tell. <laughs> what are you doing? I thought I might help you out. You were busy wiping yourself off anyway. Look, it's fine, you don't have to do that. I can give you a massage as well. It's the least I can do to atone for my sins. I'm actually pretty good at this. Fine, do what you want. Is not the answer any normal person would give in this situation. The pair would later go on to get married and have three kids. Removing a sin for the incredible level of awesomeness in this scene. 13 minutes and 10 seconds of intro and a really long recap. I hereby leave this record as my firm achievement. That is all. Focusing in on as my, as though it's the two most important words in the sentence. The computer was later pronounced dead at the scene at the hands of Kira. But it doesn't help us now. We can't continue investigating using this place as our base with L and Watari gone. 
This is tough. You can't continue investigating the case because you are still a police officer last we heard. Or did they just change all of the pre-existing storylines put in place during the last 26 episodes? I'll be able to do the same sort of work using both this computer and my own. In fact, it'll be possible for me to act as L in the comfort of my own room. Anime says lots of typing on a keyboard makes L's voice. That's cute. It's L. He's dead. L Puzzle, coming to a store near you. You're all grown up and pretty. The last time I saw you, you were this big. <laughs> It is? Uh, I mean, no way! Well, you can forget it. I'll never let Sayu marry a cop. Talking about marrying someone within 15 seconds of meeting. Yes, we want you to hand over the notebook to us. Huh? So the FBI was behind it. Where did you take the director? What are you talking about? Don't act like you don't know. This is a serious criminal offense. Attacking someone based upon assumptions. Pass on this message through our agent. Suggest to the Japanese police that we would like to assist them in rescuing the director and apprehending the culprits. We'll take the notebook once we have the opportunity. They have so many unnecessary monitors that a lot of them are showing the same or very similar things. Of all the investigators on the task force, Deputy Director Yagami would be the highest ranking, right? Whoa, I genuinely thought this dude was a woman before he opened his mouth as the coat threw me. We're gonna take both of them. Don't worry, as long as we do what Mello says, there'll be no mistakes. It's been a year and a half since he joined us, and in that entire time, he's never been wrong about anything. Yeah, but that's what's so weird. If he was able to bring us the head of a mafia boss that even Kira himself couldn't kill, why the hell would he even need the notebook to begin with? Talking directly in front of someone as though they are not in the room. It'd be interesting if it turned out to be Kira, hmm? That's a very good point. The police won't be trading their notebook if the hostage is dead, so it protects Kira's interests. Ah, uh, no one's a match for him, are they? <laughs> hey Chief, we've narrowed the call down to 5th Street in LA. I just checked out the show that was playing in the background, and it's being broadcast right now on a local LA station. Although I had no idea what show this exact scene was from in another country's TV show, I found out because I'm just that good. I'll take full responsibility for the consequences. That's my final word. Wait, Dad. Before we do anything, we have to come up with a plan. He's right, Chief. We can't rush in. But I have to be in LA in two days. We don't have time. Well, you do have time because it's 48 hours, and booking flights and getting to LA on the same day would take around 20 hours at most. So you've got, at the very least, a whole day to plan. This is L. I don't believe it. It's L. Light just happens to have their phone number handy. Director, this is L. Get me N. Right. N. I'm sure you're aware of our current situation. I wonder whose job it is to get the next bunch of items this little idiot demands so that he can look interesting and cool in front of the adults. I'm sure you're aware of our current situation. I need you to do me a favor. Can you notify the airlines, police, and military on your end not to take any action yet? What's he thinking? I never realized he was this unreliable. Talking right in front of the phone which is on speaker about the person as though they can't hear you. I'm going to give the notebook to some criminal in exchange for my daughter's life. When the time comes, what's the right thing to do? As a police officer, as a human being, and as a parent. Well, that's easy. Let her die, don't let her die, and don't let her die. L, we've been able to use our satellite cameras to pinpoint where the plane has landed. For some unknown reason, they decided to place the image on just these six monitors, when doing all nine, or indeed all of them, would actually give a much larger area to view. Despite there being a hole in the glass by her face, she can't be heard. The table he was building the dice on was also a lot bigger than this. It was a simple matter of using the death note to make Snyder send a letter to me with the location of the gang's hideout. It should be arriving soon. Hi, Light! Great news! The letter arrived! Great! News indeed. For light, I mean. And... yeah.
Siddo, go keep watch outside. It'll be very convenient for us that you can't be seen by humans. Go outside and keep watch. Got it? Telling a god that's just been proven to not be killable what to do. I will make the deal for the eyes. <sighs> no way, chief. Let me be the one to do it. The most unconvincing, no, let me do it response of all time. I was responsible for handing over the notebook in the first place. Since that moment, I've been unable to live with what I've done. I've even thought of killing myself. You've thought about killing yourself because you saved your daughter's life? What an idiot! Deputy Director, make the eye deal with the Shinigami. Alright, Ryuk, I'm ready. So you couldn't just, like, stake out the place for a day and use a pair of binoculars? You know how this works. I write your name, and you will die. Let go of that trigger and put your hands in the air. A little bit of a bad bargaining idea, given that he can pull a trigger faster than you can write down two names. Gunfire? The Future, brought to you by 110% bulletproof armor. What's the point in guns anymore? Instead of killing both of the men standing over their clearly shot or even killed friend, they take out just the one man. It's all over, Mello! Put your hands up and surrender! A bunch of ex-cops with over 40 years of experience fail to shoot a man who's clearly holding an explosive trigger. I can't see the lifespan of someone who owns a notebook, but I can see the numbers above your head. Light. You really aren't Kira. Wow, so even after being proven innocent by the fake rules in the notebook, even accepted by L himself, his father still suspected him all this time, even if just a little bit. I wonder what it's about. All they said was that it was going to be some sort of international announcement. You don't do anything but watch TV, do you? Uh, what? <clears throat> Massively long arm grabbing. Do you guys ever think that maybe Kira isn't completely evil? What? What kind of question is that, Matsuda? I've been thinking about it, and part of me just doesn't believe that he is. So now you think Kira is justice too? Yeah, haven't you looked outside lately? The world's a crime-filled mess. Oh. I don't really know. But I think that Kira's trying to fight evil and change the world in his own way. And, well, the world's become a good place for people who live honest lives, so maybe... You're wrong, Matsuda! People are only afraid of losing their own lives. How can you think that's real peace? Well, because the world has literally never known any real peace. So this is it. What's going to happen to us now? It looks like we've been disbanded, thanks to that chicken of a president. No, he's not even a chicken. He's less than a maggot. Says the kid who hides in the shadows under a fake name and isn't in any real threat himself. Which of us is gonna reach Kira first, I wonder? I sense a future diabetic is in that room. There's no way that Light could be Kira. No, it's more like I don't want to believe he's Kira, but... If the 13-day rule is fake, then we really can't say for sure that he's innocent. Aside from the fact that his father confirmed he didn't possess a notebook, I'd say under those circumstances, people's natural reaction would be to not suspect Light at all. Aizawa. Huh? We have a long history. I can tell exactly what you're thinking about and what's bothering you. Between you and me, you should go ahead and do what you think is right. Drawing a pair of fake eyebrows on his face? This is just a diversion for them. They're all selfish. Nier is a dick to toys. Let's go. This is our window of opportunity. We can leave via the front exit. Something tells me the three foot tall child in a police officer's riot uniform is going to stand out. Police come out and literally everyone leaves. 
out of curiosity, did the suspect volunteer to be detained as part of the investigation? Hmm. Come to think of it, Light did volunteer to be imprisoned. If he did, then I'd say that settles the matter, wouldn't you? All the while, no one is bringing up Light being cleared by his father on his deathbed. A huge fact that hasn't been mentioned again. Thank you very much. Your information's been quite valuable. Being too lazy to hold a f***ing phone. Especially the part about Shinigami's eyes that enable you to see other people's names. It was very helpful. Goodbye. So this was mentioned and yet Nia was entirely happy with Light being named Kira, which kind of feels rushed to me at this point, and as though the series had to be quickly pushed into its final direction no matter the facts along the way, which don't quite always add up. I want to believe that you aren't Kira, but I've got to be certain. I'm sorry to have to do this again, but I want to put you under surveillance until we catch Kira. I'm afraid that goes for Misa Amane as well. I'm gonna search your place right now. He's very confident for a guy who's not a police officer and is not even in charge of the investigation. Uh, we will unite with Kira and work with him! Delete! The best way to rip up the paper you're writing on is to throw your body around wildly whilst doing it. They don't decide to cut the broadcast when the other four die, but only when the fifth is killed. The average Japanese adult would say that Teru Mikami was a child with a strong sense of justice. Narration. There is only good and evil. That was one of the first universal truths I grasped from observing the world around me when I was a child. Every human being, without exception, ends up falling into one category or the other. Even babies? They died instantly. One bystander was killed as well. That bystander was my mother. Dead person doesn't have eyes in their photo cliché. Delete. 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 I think he's saying delete way too fast for how long it would actually take to write down a person's name. Reach out to Kira. Tell him what you think he needs to know. Instead of just sitting next to each other so as to read the notes as they are being written and without delay, these two sit apart and hand the notes to each other. Alright. I'll do it. We nailed it! No light does that afterwards. My job is to do what God wishes. I'm assuming he's only got one page left at the end, as we can see the back cover. Determine what he wants most and make our own decisions from there. El Kira is Light Yagami. Could X Kira be Teru Mikami? Jesus, there's a lot of assumptions in the back end of this anime. Basically because he saw one guy among the hundreds speaking out for Kira, he's suddenly convinced he's the man out of everyone. If they're only using wiretaps, then it's safe to assume that El Kira and X Kira have found a way to contact each other through Takara. Well, aren't you a clever boy? But I wonder how they could break the ancient riddle of communicating without words. Oh yeah, by using a f***ing notepad. I'm beginning to think he can't be ex -Kira. No, there is a very high probability that Mikami is ex -Kira. Based upon nothing more than I saw him on TV and he said he liked Kira. It's almost 100% him. Three minutes and 30 seconds of a pointless dinner which ultimately went nowhere. Is the being known as the Shinigami. The Shinigami will be loyal to Mikami and will warn him if it discovers we're following him. Do they literally just get him toys based upon the new insights they think he might come up with? No. She thinks we're together because I haven't been able to break it to her yet. But she means nothing to me. Misa, you idiot. Why pull a stunt like that? No, Takeda, you're just as bad. Why are women like this? That's womanist. She was in charge of killing before tea. Somehow she gained the same power as I had, and found out that I was Kira. In the end, I had no choice but to take her as my partner. It's the only reason I would ever choose such an impulsive girl. Yeah, this super long silence isn't suspicious at all. At this point he talks to himself a little more. 
I'm gonna zoom in on his lips. That Shinigami. You can't make an image with a certain amount of pixels suddenly have more when you zoom in like this. I left four marks. Two of them are gone. The room's been left just as it was. Housekeeping hasn't come in yet. This hotel gives you about 3,000 pieces of paper. In fact, I've already taken it into account as part of my plan. That's why I'm hoping you can help me in that respect. Ugly looking Death Note dolls that wouldn't have really been made, coming to a store near you. Near. Kidnapping is a blatant criminal act. You have to stop this now. Actually, Mr. Mogi and Amane both came here willingly. You can even ask them yourself. I'll put them on the line now. Here they are. Typing a few letters on the keyboard brings up the camera footage of where the two of them are. Actually, I was against the whole thing, but Mochi said it would be best if I just went along quietly. He told me we would have both been killed if I didn't. All right. It's fine as long as you both consented to this. Obviously, she did not consent to it, given that she had to be told you'll either go along with it or you'll be killed. A real expert at following someone can be standing literally right behind you and not be noticed. One of the attackers was heavily armed. As of this moment, both Miss Takada's escort team and the police are hot on the tail of the suspects. Having a smoke grenade is considered being heavily armed. <laughs> Parking the cars like this leaves two big car-sized holes at the top left and top right. Hey, come on, give me a break. Since when were the Japanese allowed to carry around such big guns? Now he's at it as well. A normal sized handgun is not a big gun. It's a gun. Normal sized. This man, he's the person that Light warned me to be extra careful of. Mello. Mihail Kale. And I'm judging this by the back of his helmet. B before I take off the rest, could I please have the blanket so I can wrap it around me? Whatever you want. Well in that case, I want to put my f***ing clothes back on, you pervert. I don't believe this. Aizawa and Ide are just too stupid. No seatbelt. Lidner. Giovanni. Let's put our best into this, shall we? This? This reminds me of something. I appreciate it. Thank you. Well then, we'll see you shortly. TV turning off sound effects lets us know it's turning off. Rare moment catches near and light playing the children's game of who can open their mouths the least while smiling. Delete, 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 delete! How it should have ended. Just going to say here that this character was actually really cool, so removing a sin. We only switched part of the fake notebook, but as for the real one, we replaced the entire thing. SPK is armed with brand new see-through gun grips. It was only at this time that he seemed concerned whether someone was following him or not. I got into his safe deposit box. Inside was the real notebook. And he managed this by anime logicking the shit out of the situation and boom, it popped open. However, another rule says that if you use the notebook, you won't be able to go to heaven or hell. Seems even the gods of death don't know shit about death. It's the only way to see if it's real. Or fake! He's hidden a piece of the notebook! <laughs> Giving away your plan by shouting like a moron when all you've done is gotten the paper out. <laughs> this happens. How it should not have ended. 
Hey everyone, I just wanted to thank you all for watching through this series, which took me around 100 hours to complete from start to finish. I really appreciate all of the likes, comments and support in general you've shown me. If you would like to have a say in which series is covered next, be sure to hit the Patreon link coming up in a moment in the top right hand side of your screen. I've got some great rewards and I hope you check it out to support me. And as always, I'll see you in the next one. Nathan Byrne, Bird Without a Word, Arias Alibari, Egan White, PK Fan, Ali 50, Ryan Anderson, Isael Caldera, Chris Harris, Yola Shal, Manolo Saucedo Munoz, Luis Hernandez, Kim Munt, Jason Davies, Yuki Ali, Manuel Morales, Dark Lord Bloody Soul, Sentimento, Jeffa 6263, Amy San, Alfredo Jimenez, Silva, Master Tank, Boogie, Kevin Nelter, Stefia, Brendan Crea, Storm 970, Mr. Waffle 64, Bongola Ninja, Kaj Warzelman, Jordan Samuels, Sean Graves, The Epic Amanda, Crimson Shadows, Kyle Farmer, Buzzbomb 3000, Adorable, Yagai 7636, Mr. Berigino.